Hey guys, I thought I would do a video on this after our live show that we do every Tuesday night. One of the questions we were getting was someone talking about how they have a multi-zone mini split. So they have one outdoor unit with multiple indoor heads or evaporator units, whatever you want to call them. And they didn't get real specific on what they have exactly inside, meaning do they have wall mount units? Do they have floor mount units, ducted mini splits? We didn't get into all of that. But one of the things they were talking about is how they have to have all of the units in the same mode and how big of a headache that could be sometimes, especially if you have a little bit of a larger home and you might have a unit on one floor and you want to switch it from cooling to heating. You've got to run upstairs to get the other unit moved over to the same mode and things like that. It sometimes can be, you know, a little less fun, right? Just trying to get them all in the same mode so you can get a little heat. And so, you know, this is a problem that is not uncommon, that there are multiple systems out there, multiple brands making systems, different types of systems that have the same function. It's the technology that's in the system that all of the units have to be in the same mode so that way you can turn it from one mode to the other. And again, it could be quite inconvenient at times. Well, there is a solution out there and I will say it's very limited. It's not like there are tons of residential systems out there that have this technology, but the verbiage you want to be looking for, if you are in the market for a heating and air system, you've got your heart set on many splits of some kind and you wanna have the functionality or the ability to have one zone in cooling, one zone in heating, one zone off, and so on. You want different modes on different units, even though they're all still sharing that same outdoor unit. And the verbiage you're looking for is something called heat recovery. That's the verbiage that a lot of the brands are using. It's the type of technology that the system uses. And all of these systems typically have three sets of line sets instead of just two. So usually when you have a split system and you have your copper lines, you might have a larger one. In cooling mode, we'll call that the suction line. And then we call the smaller line, the liquid line. But in these heat recovery units, there's actually three line sets. And you know, again, it's the technology so that refrigerant can be flowing through them in different directions and so on. So as you're looking across the industry, the array of products, you wanna be finding ones that say heat recovery on them. We are a Daikin dealer. Daikin has their Daikin 4 series heat recovery. They do make the Daikin 4 heat recovery series all the way down to six tons. So, you know, if you have a larger home, you're trying to get multiple mini splits installed, you can do up to 12 indoor units on this Daikin 4 heat recovery unit. And again, they could be in different modes. So this isn't a commercial for that necessarily. There are other brands and other products out there with that heat recovery technology. Just thought I would throw one out there that you could look at. So wrapping up, if this is the type of technology that you're looking for, I would definitely stick to some of the bigger brands out there like Daikin and Mitsubishi and these mini split kings, if you will. I would not just settle for any old unit on the internet that says heat recovery, but you are going to most likely have to go with some sort of VRF or VRV system where the refrigerant is variable, but that's a whole topic for a whole nother video. You want to look for units that say heat recovery. That's the verbiage you're looking for. If you want that functionality, let me know if this helps. Please comment down below. We appreciate you watching. Please hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time.